What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Landeris. You already know. You see it. You see it. LNL Lawn Service, Kansas City, Missouri. Blue Springs area. Mm -hmm. Back at you. Hey. Oh, man. Today was a rough day today. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I got up this morning thinking that I was going to use my Toro uh time master and uh i went to start it up and tried to engage the the blades and the the cable broke and i'm like oh my god so i took that in no telling when i'm gonna get that back they said they'll try to get to it as soon as possible i got a good relationship with the lawn and leisure guys up there so hopefully they'll have it back to me uh soon and then i was trying to start my 52 inch skag v-ride 2 and the battery was low so i went and got the battery charger and then uh I got the battery charger, then I hooked it up to it and saw the voltage. Then I tried to crank it up and it looked like it was going to crank a little bit. And then uh, I put it on my battery charger has a, you know, uh, a boost on there where you can start the engine or start whatever you got. So I hit that and after I did that, it didn't do anything. It looked like it was going to turn, but it didn't. So, uh, I turned the key one more time, and then the tiger, the tiger uh, eye gauges went off, and all the lights on the tiger eye went off. So, I'm assuming it's maybe a fuse. So, when I took my skag up there, the, one of the guys that work up there on lawnmowers told me probably check the check the uh the the fuse on there so i gotta go in here and check the fuse and then when i was doing a leaf cleanup and mulching up leaves this tire was going flat so i gotta check this tire out but it was going flat for whatever reason, I'm not sure. So we'll see if it holds up tonight. Put some more air in it tomorrow. But it should hold up tonight. I don't know if it's a slow leak or what, but I got to take care of that. I probably need to change the tires on here. The treads are getting bad where if I put the brake on... It's, it's not catching on to the tires or it's not catching on good enough to the tires. So sometimes that's an indicator that you need uh, um, your treads are going bad and your brake that engages on here is not, it's not, uh, the tires are getting worn out. So it's not catching as good to, uh, when you put that brake system on, so. It'll still break, but say, for instance, if I had it, you know, on this incline a little bit, it'll start going back like this. Like it's trying to catch, trying to catch some, some tread, but it's not. And then, it, it yeah, so uh, it might be some time for some new tires on there. So we'll see. All right, guys, that's my time. <clears throat> Rough day today. All right, but it is what it is. Starting out, get all the kinks out, get stuff serviced uh, that end up breaking on you right away. <laughs> you know, I try to start all my stuff up before I leave every morning. Try to crank my, my lawnmower up, make sure that it cranks up, crank my blowers up, crank my... my uh, my weed eaters up before I even take off because sometimes you'll take off and then thinking it's 
all your equipment is good and you'll get to a get to a place, get to your destination, and then next thing you know, something's not working or whatever the case is. So uh always do a a check check of everything in the morning before you take off tire pressures things like that all right guys hey if you haven't subscribed to my channel like right now go ahead and subscribe to it hit that bell button uh hit that notification uh do whatever you gotta do but you better do it all right guys i'm out peace